What's up guys, my name is Michael and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to do another lead code challenge. It's called Univalued Binary Tree. A binary tree is univalued if every node in the tree has the same value. Return true if and only if the given tree is univalued. <coughs> As you can see here, this is a binary tree. All the values are the same. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. Okay? So it returns true. Oh yeah, you could also have null. So here, this value is null and they're fine with that. So, yeah. As you can see here, there's one five. Therefore, it returns false because this should be a two. They should all have the values of two. But there's a five here, that's why it's false. It's not univalued. So, I'll give you a few minutes to do this yourself and then I'll go over the solution. All right, to go over the solution, basically we need to check that the left tree, left side, is univalued Univalue, univalued. We have to check if the left side is univalued and we have to check if the right side is univalued. Okay, that's what I'm going to tell you guys because they both have to be univalued. The left side and the right side. They both have to be univalued in order for this to work. And they both have to be univalued. So we have to return left side univalued and right side right side uni valued okay <clears throat> so I'm just explaining the left side have to, has to be uni valued and the right side has to be uni valued okay so how does the left side have to be uni valued well either in order for the left side to be uni valued the, le the, the left tree of the root has to be uni valued so is univalued tree we have to check if the left part of the tree is univalued and is the right side univalued we have to check is univalued tree is the right part univalued okay so but it's not just that okay it's not just that we also have to check is the left side null okay and we have to check if the value at the current root is equal to the roots left and the value at the current node root is equal to roots right rights value okay that's what we have to do so one thing, the thing, so we have to check is root roots value is it equal to roots left left value I think that's how it works, yeah is it equal to roots left value and this and then we have to check is roots right uh, roots value equal to roots right value okay because otherwise if, it, if it's not then we know it's not a univalued tree because the roots value the values have to be the same okay so that's what this is doing and then another th condition we have to check is uh, if the roots left is null, then it doesn't matter about this condition at all. So this whole condition would not matter because we could have the left value as null. So it wouldn't matter. So we got to check roots left is equal to null. And if it is, then it wouldn't matter. So we have an or or statement. Okay, then we don't do the this right part. Okay, and we got to check if roots right is null. Because if it's if right's null, then it could also be right side univalued. Okay, let's run the code. See if this changes anything. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. It's taking an awfully long time. Something's not right. Did I do something wrong? I'm pretty sure I'm doing it right. Let's just check the solution to make see if it's if I'm doing this correctly. Yeah, left, right, and yeah. Okay, yeah, so I did this right. Right side, right is equal to null. Or right dot value is equal to root dot value is root dot value. And right side. Okay, yeah, so that that should be right. It's just taking a while. I think it's my internet speed is pretty low. But Essentially, this is how you would do it. It's taking awfully a long time. That's so strange. Okay. Uh, I'm going to refresh the page. But yeah, that's basically how you would do it. I think my inter internet speed is pretty bad. But yeah. That was basically the solution. You had to check if the left side... Is left left if root is root's value is equal to the left side and the left subtree is is a univalued tree, then the left side is univalued, or if the if the left side is null, then it could also be univalued because it doesn't matter. If the left side's null, it doesn't really matter. Check if the right side's null. If the right side's null, it doesn't really matter. But what really matters is a uh, you have to check if the right's value is equal to roots value. Okay? The right subtree of value is equal to roots value. Because this this part one one has to be the same. See the right subtree one has to be the same as this the main tree. The main node of one one one. Okay? And the right the rest of the right subtree has to be univalued. So that's basically how you do it. Also a minute. Give a few minutes, seconds time but yeah that's basically how you do it very comfortable subscribe i'll check you guys later peace